Hello all and welcome back to my channel. My name is Chandramani Pandey and thank you very much for watching my other videos. In this video, I will show you how we can create dynamic group in Intune for Windows 11 24 2 devices. So to do this, we have to go to the Intune portal and within Intune portal, we have to go to the groups. And then within the groups, we have to select all groups and click on new group. Here the group type should be security and provide the group name. Here I'm going to provide Windows 11 24 H2. Same thing I'm going to provide under the description. And in the membership type, we have to click on and select the dynamic devices because we want to create a dynamic device group. And in the dynamic device membership, add dynamic query rule. Click on this. And in the property, we have to select the device OS version and the operator is starts with and the value we have to put here is 10.0.261 because windows 11 24 has to build version starts with 261 that is why i'm adding 261 and then we have to click on the validate rule and here we can validate our dynamic query rule is working or not so we have to add some machine let me add three demo lab machine so that I can show you the difference and click on select. Now we can see that for first and third machine, the status is showing as green, meaning that both the machines are on Windows 11 24 H2 and the second machine is showing as red, meaning that this machine is not on Windows 11. If we click on the view details, we can see that as per query, the device operating system version should start with 10.0.261 for this machine the version is 22631 that is why the machine is not getting added automatically in this dynamic group so this way we can ensure that the our dynamic query is working or not by adding the machine and validating the query click on ok and then click on save and click on create now we have to wait for some time so that it will automatically populate the Windows 11 24 H2 device in that particular group. So now let me spot that group again and click on this. And if you go to the members, now we can see that both the machines are automatically added in the group and we can also check the dynamic membership rule. I hope this is an informative video for you. Thank you very much for watching this video.